Hi kids, in this video I am going to discuss about how to perform left circular rotation of an array in Cisau.net. So add here this is the code to perform left circular rotation. So suppose if you enter add here this element 86421. So add here left value that moves to last. So if I execute this code, add here I am getting the output 64218. So add here 8 in last. Now, here after I am going to explain this code. So this code that I pasted here. So if you debug the code, control comes to main method. Here after that go inside. So add here I have taken integer single dimension array A and this is the element that I store. So add here add 0 index that come 8, 1 index 6, here after 4 and last. 21. Now here after move method and here that tries to find the base the move method. So add here that comes to this position and here is the array time a double or this receive this or and make. Now here after that go inside so add here a double int t a double or length. So add here total numbers of element 4 so that here this return 4 add here and this t at here is now 4. Now here after this 10, now here j value start from t minus 1, 4 minus 1 that is 3. Here after 3 greater than 0 condition is true, so that coincide, so at here a double on t minus 1, 4 minus 1, 3. So 3 position value go to 10, so at here 21 comes to 10. Now here after a double on j minus 1, j value is now 3, 3 minus 1, 2. And here 2 position value is now 4. Uh, that go to a double on uh, t minus 1, that is 4 minus 1, 3. So at here 2 position value go to 3. So this 4 move to this position. So at here that is uh, 4. Now here after next is tan move up to a double or j minus 1 so 3 minus 1 2 so tan value is now 21 that move to at here or 2 position so at here this position 2 21 comes now here many changes with 1 index and 0 index now here after the next is that go on decrease the value of j there is not 2 2 greater than 0 condition is to that coincides so at here 8 over or t minus 1 4 minus 1 3 so 3 position value go to 10 so at here 3 position is now at here 4 and this 4 move to 10 and here after 8 over or j minus 1 so j value is now 2 2 minus 1 that is 1 so 1 position is now at here 6. 6 move to a double or 3 position. So this 6 comes to this point and here after this position is now come 6. And here after time value go to a double or j minus 1. So at a time value is now or j value is now 2, 2 minus 1 that is 1. So time value is 4, 4 that move to this position. So this position is now at here 4. Now here after that decrease the value. So this become 1. 1 less than 1 greater than 0 condition is true. So at here a double or t minus 1. t minus now 4. 4 minus 1 that is 3. So 3 position value go to 10. So 3 position 6 is then 6 that go to 10. Now here a double or j minus 1. So 1 minus 1 that is 0. So 0 position value go to 8 over or 3. So 0 position add here 8. 8 move to this position add here 3. So here this is 8 now. Here after time value go to 8 over or j minus 1. So time value is now move to 8 over or 0 position. So 6 is now move to this. And here after the next is no any changes at here 4 and here this is 21. Now here after that go off and 
decrease the value of i. i is not 0, 0 getting 0 condition false. So this is not to inside here after 8 over r, new value of 8 over r is odd. 6, 4, 21, 8. So see and here 8 is not moved to last and here after 6, 4, 21. And this 1 by 1 go to n and here after that go inside 1 by 1 that print and here in value so 6 print 4 print 21 print and next 8 print so after completion of this move control back to this position move method here after this take one input from keyboard and terminate the output screen so this is the steps of execution of this program so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week